Hello friends, welcome back to the channel. And in this video, I'm going to flip through my completed October pages in my planner, in my mini happy planner, and my traveler's notebook. Also showing you what I'm using for November. And I do have a del one of my 2024 planners. So, I'm gonna start off with the mini happy planner. I did do, I did cover the original dashboard because why not? And so I decorated every week, but I necessarily didn't come back and fill in stuff, but I do like decorating the mini happy planner. I haven't bought one for 2020, um, for yet because I didn't like the theme that they had. I think it's a mom theme. I said that I would just wait until, um, when to release to see if they have anything different or maybe I won't get one this next year. But this is Halloween week. I hope you had a very nice spooky Halloween. And I don't know if I've decorated. Oh, I did decorate. Okay. Usually I have decorate the whole month in advance, but I haven't done the last week apparently. Which is, oh no, last two weeks. Let's say we're Thanksgiving. Anyways, that's my mini happy planner. I still love it. Oh, and the cover is from OK Plans. I always put this cover on around Halloween. And this is my insert. This insert is a traveler's notebook insert with like 64 pages, gridded pages. So, oops. Yeah. This is how it turned out. I do enjoy the traveler's notebook inserts because you can date it yourself and all that stuff i used a lot of date stickers from let's plan it but um it is hard to fill up one insert a month because it is 64 pages so you should use about two pages per um two pages per day and to me i think i got busy in october and i got tired too so i didn't necessarily need a whole two pages every time not even every week I think and then this is how it turned out I do like these pages um, and I was gonna use this to put some TVs and movies that I watched in October but I haven't and in the back I just have some receipts and stuff so that's my traveler's notebook and so that's a traveler's notebook TN by the actual people that makes Traveler's Notebook stuff. And so for this month, I am playing with a, a Coco Daisy insert. So she has the calendar on the front um, and she has the weeks up front. And I've went through and I decorated um, most of these things. I don't know how I'm gonna use this section yet. This week I used it as a big to-do list, but we'll see. And this is how it's turning out. It's Friday. And so I've already decorated the pages with some Happy Planner stickers or any kind of stickers that I just had around. Um, enjoying the process. Because I, I can decorate pages and I'll be fine. I know I'll be fine to write in them. Um, and I'm liking how this is turning out. And so with this one, I think there is 30 pages for each day. So it's one day per page only. And we'll see if that works out because sometimes I do write a lot and sometimes I don't. But then also I've said I could do sticky notes and all that stuff. So we'll see how this turns out um, because I, I sort of like the idea of having a notebook every month and decorating the outside and all that. And the Traveler's Notebook is really fun and Coco Daisy does have different sizes too. So like maybe I could try out all the sizes. So my 2024 planner has arrived. This is gonna be a journal, right? Yeah, this is more than likely gonna be a journal, not a planner planner. I got my first ever Motrim, 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 whatever. Motrim is a medicine, Motern. I'll put a link in my bio. Um, <laughs> I got it, I forgot what color I got, but I like the color orange and this to me looks pretty orange to me. Um, so yeah, I like it. <laughs> um, 
I haven't decorated any of the pockets. Uh, I don't know. I like it. Um, I thought I wouldn't like the, the, the pocket, but it's not like causing any issue with me using it. Um, so, so yeah, this is the take a note planner, uh, a five size, a five cover. Oh, and it can fit the plastic cover on cover. If you're wondering, I think I saw some other videos and they said that, um, I don't know what I'm going to use this for. This might be my goals for the year. Um, the first time I used the take a note planner in 2022, I think they didn't have this section. So I don't know. This is like what the Hobonichi has. I don't know how I'm going to use that yet, but I'm going to try to use the monthlies as like a fun functional planning. I don't have that much stuff to do per month, so I don't think it's going to ever be full. But if I have extra boxes from kits and stuff, it's a good way to use up kits. <laughs> um, and I love that guy. Okay. And this is, I, I wanted to make sure I use the Coffee Monsters Co. pink washi I had for February. Um, I do plan to get her washi sets for each month, but I don't think I'm going to use them for each month. Um, so then the ticket note planner is the week on four page. No, one week on two pages or four on four pages. So Mon like you have a weekly section, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Um, and honestly, I want to say this will be my daily journal. Um, but I do enjoy like long form journaling and I, I don't know. I don't know how my everything's, I don't know what everything's going to be used for because this was my initial idea and I've been playing with this at the end of the month at the end of the year so I feel like this might be a daily journal and this more might be stickers but then if I do stickers I know it's gonna get thick um I do also have a hemlock and oak undated insert coming um but I haven't received it so I don't know I don't know how I don't know the purpose for each thing yet and that's why I'm like I'm not sure if I need a mini happy planner so my 2024 plans are in the works until I get my Hemlock and Oak insert because I don't know, since the, since the Hemlock and Oak inserts are undated, I might not use them because I got a dated planner, this. So I'm going to continue to use these three, oh well, not these three things. I'll continue to use these two things in November. I will probably have a take a note, I will have a take a note, um, a traveler's notebook of some sort, and then either a hemlock and oak or mini happy planner in the works we don't know we're just gonna go with the flow i usually have everything figured out by now but this year hemlock and oak always takes a while to deliver and i know the inserts came after the actual book planner so i can only imagine how far down i'm on the list but hopefully it'll come in november and i'll show you guys that too but yeah this is my has been me flipping through my planners. Um, have you guys figured out your 2024 plans? I feel like there's a lot of options. So I feel like a lot of people are in the same boat of like, I don't know what I'm actually going to use. I got stuff though. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.